Now, breaking news. Breaking news tonight in the case of Natalie Holloway, nearly 18 years after her disappearance, the man accused of killing her is coming to the United States to face charges related to her death. Hello everyone, I'm Brenda Ledun. And I'm Ariel Bailey. ABC 3340's Stephen Quinn is at the live desk with more on this developing story. Stephen? Muriel, prosecutors say that Urine Vandersloot took $25,000 in cash from Natalie Holloway's family, promising to lead them to her body. It has still never been found. Right now, Vandersloot is in a Peruvian prison after he pleaded guilty to murdering a college student there five years after Holloway's disappearance. Now, Peru's extradition order bringing him to the States is temporary. The nation's ambassador saying that he hopes that this move will bring peace to Natalie Holloway's family. And her mother said in a statement about this news, quote, it has been a very long and painful journey, but the persistence of many is going to pay off. Together, we are finally going to get justice for Natalie. And the story, of course, made national headlines after the Mountain Brook High School graduate disappeared during a senior trip to Aruba back in 2005. Natalie was 18 years old when she disappeared 18 years ago. Brenda. 